And we're back. In black. <laughs> Hello. Reduce the GPU base clock by 200 and memory base clock by 230. All right, where were we? Oh yeah, we entered here. Now let's go. At these underclock speeds, I'm starting to notice an ob a notice a difference in the performance of Unity, but it's very minute, and I'm no stranger to I'm honestly no stranger to the sword to reduce reduce quality. It's just that after you run with such a nice car for so long, you kind of want come to expect a certain performance. It could just mean that maybe it's time for me to move on from a 1080 Ti and start getting a look into finding a modern day car, but that's really expensive. So it'll take a while. Let's try and get as much life out of this GTX 1080 Ti as I can before making that kind of decision, you know? Mm hmm. Yeah, that's true. That's weird. Why do I have more... Did I... I thought I... That's weird. Hmm. I thought I dropped a lot of this stuff. Like the hatchet and whatnot. Stupid GPU market indeed. Oh, that's why I drank a bunch of... Hmm. Well, anyway. Let's move on. Oh, what, were, what was I doing before we crashed? Oh, yeah. We're heading back home to Chersno to sell my loot. Following this, yellow, this purple brick road back there. I still want to find Yuzan's stash, but I don't know where it is, so we'll need to keep continue our look searching for it elsewhere. Hmm. Man, though, aren't these colors beautiful? Look at that. Oh man, I'm getting tired. <laughs> Looks like it's epic meal time. Hmm. 
Ooh, what's this? Leave me alone, bird, or I'm going to stab the shit out of you. Okay. <laughs> North was home to Jerzo Village, which is more like a town instead of a village because God it is big. I was mugged over here last time too. So peaceful. So peaceful that I'm actually looking at my GPU monitor here as opposed to paying attention to the road. Which could not totally will not end well for me, right? But I'm pretty sure I'm also pretty close to Shirazo at this point. Why is there blood on the ground here? That might be something to look into later. I think we're back home. Mm-hmm. Thank you. Now to sell our excess crap. What can I do for you? Oh, 
All right. What can you do for me? A lot of things, my friend. A lot of things. This thing goes for 60 silver. What the hell? Hmm. I'm not much. I'm not one for clubs anyway. I can use this to make craft new alloys along with these things over here. And I can just sell this. But I think I'll be needing this to unlock something in the Trog Cave that I saw earlier. Definitely don't need this either. Can I sell my shiv? He's not buying shivs. I guess not. Uh, I feel lighter already. Oh, he ripped me off. Really? 200 silver? Was that like an end stage end game item or something? I could really use some nice armor though. Or bare failing that, some guns. Okay, buy some tea or collect some of these items for them. Nah. Chakram spells. So you can't just throw chakrams at people. What else is there to do in this town anyway? Like this magician can't teach me anything until I learn magic. Let's ask you. Can I help you? Alright, now that I got silver, let's see if I can learn some skills to help me not die as quickly in battle. Check these guys out. Japanese people. <laughs> if you manage to make your opponent stumble, that's your advantage. And blunt weapons. Well, this person. What can I do for you? Uh, old hermit in the valley beyond the ghost pass. It's a dangerous journey, but his knowledge of magic is fast. To learn the spells of the Cabal of Winds. There's no better teacher. Hmm. A Kazite Spellblade? You need an infused weapon or a magic or weapon infused with magic. Wow. Shoot a projectile of the weapon of the elements infused in your weapon. Temporarily adds fire damage to your melee weapon and inflicts burning on enemies. Consumes your warm boon. So do these all need magic or only some of them? Oh, this is if you become a spell blade, I see. 
And you need a breakthrough point, of which you only have three. And you also need credits, obviously. Oh, check this out. So you can increase your stats. This is definitely important. Learn that, please. Thank you. Increase your impact resistance by 10 while you're blocking. So I should be a little bit stronger now, right? Theoretically speaking. Nice sword. Looks like it's falling apart, though. Really wish I had a house. Still. If someone had taken it back, hadn't, hadn't foreclosed on it in game. What can I do? Craft me something. Blue sand. Okay, so I need to grind a lot of silver and give him blue sand in order to... How much blue sand do I even have? Only one? That's going to take a while. But I need this to craft amylite armor. What can, I do for you? All right. can you just buy my stuff for off of me? That'd be great. I'll keep the blue sand since apparently I need that, but... Hmm. I'll keep the aquamarine too. All right, 69 silvers for this. Not bad, not bad. I really need better armor, my dude. But, <sighs> hit, man. So expensive. Thank you. I still have so much stuff to unload. They are useful things, nonetheless. Am I winning, lulls? Well, I found a, someone who could teach me some skills, and I sold some junk to make room for more junk, so I would say I am relatively winning, all things considered. I have a vague idea of what I want, of what I need to do, also. Which to be seems to be to basically get some equipment, learn some skills, and then head out of Tresor or Serzano. So all things considered, yeah, I'm doing pretty okay. Pretty okay. I think what I need to do, what the game wants me to do now, is to find blue sand armor to have him craft me some blue armor and weapons.
crystal powder. Haven't found any of that yet. No, don't eat that. Oh, shit. Not again. I'm dumb. And I don't have anything for he healing and digestion either. Shit. I ate the shrimp by accident when I meant to move it to my backpack. And because I ate it raw, I got sick. Because you get sick in this game. Yeah. And I don't remember... And until I cure this, I can't eat any food properly. So if I'm not careful, these are going to spoil. Thankfully, and I need to re I need to remember which one of these things actually makes the tea that I need. So I sure as hell don't remember which one of these potions does that. Was it the spicy bitter tea? Or is it a soothing tea? No, um... One of these teas... A tea... Cures indigestion, and I forget which one it is. But you know what? It's sold over here at the mana place, so... At the magic store, so... Hey there. Mineral tea. And it costs 70 silver. Oh my god. Wait, nope. How much does it cost? 8 silver. Okay. Good. I don't need 48 of them. Just... I just need one. Just give me one. In return, you can have this uh, fruit thing. There we go. There, cure indigestion. Holy shit, I'm dumb. Hope that doesn't happen again. Man, you can tell that the underclocking is working because my avatar is a lot slower, a lot more janky than it was earlier. But I am still moving, which is more than, which is definitely something. Let us make a bunch of this. What else can we make here? We're going out fishing.
I still don't know how I'm supposed to get over there to the crash get or where the crash ship that the that Yuzan was talking about is. I'd really like to know so I can find his stash. Oh man, am I getting tired or what? Rainbow trap? Can I make meats too? With... I guess not. Oh man, I'm tired. <laughs> this game does get tiring sometimes. Kind of stressful too, actually. I'm thinking about that because I'm getting really tired. This game is... I like this game a lot. It's just that it's the kind of game that... Is... Takes a lot of effort to play, I guess. It's fatiguing. Especially since you have to do so much thinking. I think I will take a break from... Outward for today find something less stressful to play. I also totally just realized that I did not that I still have the options menu open over here in VT plus. <laughs> so what should we do in the meanwhile? Yeah, I feel that. So originally I had this at GPU was reduced by 50 megahertz and memory clock was by 150 and I increased it to 200 and 230 because I can't seem to reduce this to an even 200 which is triggering me a bit. Wait, there we go. I lied. And assuming that this is working properly, it should be... Because if you do this, 1746, 
I do. Ta-da! And I can increase the... Uh, you know what? Hmm. Can I copy this? Just chatting. Just chatting only copy. Turn this off. Move this here. Properties. A thousand. Ah. Huh. How nice. Mm. Very nice. We sure have come a long way, haven't we? Mm-hmm. Oh, that's dumb. Why is it doing that? Shit. One second. So, remove this. Scene. Okay, uh, add browser source. Huh? I'm still here. Oh, Millie! So, so sorry, I was so busy trying to fix my uh, chat box, I didn't realize that i just been raided. And not only that, but because for some reason OBS did not uh, fire up when that when you came by. May I need to fix my, unfuck my alert box or something? Uh, thank you for raiding. How was your stream tonight? What were you playing today? And actually, you know what? Better idea. How about, there you go. Uh, what were you playing? <laughs> Master Duel again. Wait. Actually, didn't I see you playing that earlier this afternoon? You were still playing up to now. <laughs> Just barely beat you. Uh, it uh, is this correct? Is this five twenty? That works. Go switch here to just chatting. Switch this to just chatting as well. <laughs> A four or five hour stream. <laughs> Did you enjoy yourself? Nice. I'm glad to hear it. Congratulations. <laughs> I managed to go almost a full stream without crashing once. Um, two hours, and then at the, literally at the two hour mark, suddenly my graphics, my computer froze, and it wasn't just like one screen this time. It was like the whole thing. 
but because of the SSD, I was able to restart very quickly, went back and got back on stream, and then I just lowered the underclock of my rig even lower. And yesterday we didn't even crash at all, so... Oh, that's what you were doing? <laughs> I should probably play some music in the background too or something. Uh, wait, what's going on here? One second. Mm -hmm. Copy this. Post this here. Play that. It's fine. Didn't it find it strange that the intro theme plays, but OBS can hear it, but I cannot hear. But I cannot hear it myself through desktop audio, which I guess makes sense because if I did, it would probably go through desktop audio, and if it went to desktop audio, um, bad stuff would happen probably. You think so? I mean, I could make it bigger. That's no big deal at all. And I'll put myself here in the center. Hello! Am I big enough for you now? <laughs> um, I mean, I don't know. This is just a template made by Lorelei. It's Lorelane, I should say. So who knows what she originally intended for it. I could un unironically go bigger. Really? How big should I go? Do, 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 do. I'm like bigger than the whole fucking. And also, the chat box is on the other side. Before, when I had the fourth monitor attached to my graphics card, I would just look to the right. And I would be looking. It would be as if I was looking at chat, but now I can't do that. Unless, however, I were to turn off mirror mode, which I can also do. So now, I can look at the chat. The only problem is I have to kind of futz around with. Yeah, I bet. I do, but that's where the recent followers and recent subscribers thing is. So. I could do that, I suppose. I mean... Isn't this kind of excessive? Just a little bit. Just a bit. Mm -hmm. I think this is enough for me, personally. Mm -hmm. This size. Man, those weeks and weeks and weeks of going to bed late have really done me in. I went to bed last night around midnight. I fell asleep playing gacha games. Who would have thought? Pretty sure your model goes under the recents anyway. Well, yeah, like right here. All right, no problem, Millie. I mean, I'm going to pass out in like 20 minutes or so, so. <laughs> so I need I need to know about the frozen diet pizza again, or what of it, I should say. Tell me uh, the, the horrors of this frozen diet pizza. Hmm. 
My model goes underneath the layers? I am underneath the layers, though. Ta-da! It's now covering my face. Hmm. I got sick from one I ate that was just laying around in the fridge. I didn't cook it well enough. Well, I'm glad you didn't get any sicker than that. I've heard... I was watching a chubby... I, there's a chubby emu video on eating leftover pizza. <laughs> Right here. Since we are busy speedrunning metal units, I guess I could pop on there and see how, how much farther I can get before dinner time and or passing out while also chatting with y'all. Because I can afford to play Metal Unit and fuck and uh, piss around on chat at the same time, which is really convenient. If it weren't aside from synthetic, I guess Metal Unit is one of those games that I really can just turn off my brain to play, which, as you might imagine, is fairly convenient. Ah, I don't know how to spell. There we go. Mm-hmm. I actually beat the first boss. So, uh, again. <laughs> again. So, maybe what we can do is just go ahead and... I wonder how long it'll take me to get back. Ow! Ow! Thank you for throwing something at my face, Suda Fish. It was much appreciated. Sarcasm? What's that? <laughs> How you doing? Yeah. Well, at least you solved my eating problem. Now, if only I can just reach 40. Come on. Come on. Come on. Ah, it disappeared before I could do anything about it. All right. And we are back to this game. Do I dare... Do I dare attempt to play through all this again and getting all the masteries so I can start the final missions with legendary weapons? The answer, of course, is yes. But right now, I'm trying to make my way through it as quickly as possible. I'm not spending another 20 hours playing this game just to get to... 20 hours. No, it's gotta be under 20 hours. That's the problem. Here's hoping it doesn't crash, but I don't think it's going to since we played Metal Unit yesterday with no crash, and today we got pretty far and outward on two hours, and that was with a 50 or 150 underclock, over, underclock. So I can only imagine. Also, this time, I saved my save file, so if that shit happens again, I'm just going to reload. 24 hour subathon? You know, I don't know how to feel about subathons. Are those basically just things where you sort of beg for money? Or how does a subathon work? I don't understand the concept, to be honest. The concept of subathon kind of scares me, to be honest. I don't, I don't understand.
Okay. Hmm. I'm so slow. My character is so slow. Okay. Uh, now I should another shitty spear. But this will do. Ooh, improved sniper rifle. And hold on to Jethro armor, I guess. Oh, no. Ooh, tortellini. Enjoy. <laughs> Bread and fried craft dinner in the air fryer. Each time someone subs, it adds time to your timer. Streamers make bank on them, and viewers get to keep their favorite streamers from having any sort of life outside of stream for a given amount of time. I don't quite understand it either. It seems like a begging for money unless it's for a charity. Mushy mushy. Yep, dinner is ready, but I'm going to see if I can, how quickly I can make it through one more run of Forestia before we do that. Which I will need to grind a little bit in this game because this game is pretty much built around grinding. You can't progress unless you grind a little bit to increase to get these stupid crystal cores. So I don't mind. It doesn't feel natural at all, and I kind of feel embarrassed to if I were to have to do that personally. I mean, if people want to, I mean, it's their stream, people can do what they like, it's just, it feels very odd to me, I guess. But hey, if people are willing to be given the money for that sort of thing, then who am I to judge, right? <laughs> alright, alright, alright. Temporarily forgot how to attack just then. Oh, wow, okay, I destroyed those things a little bit too easy at time. Sure, can item acquired. <laughs> you know, I can't help but feel like this game was updated or something in the time between when I first started playing and now because. I don't know why, but there are some things about it that just seem different. I don't remember there being so many metal chunks just uh, sitting around, for example. Because there have been a lot of them. Mm. Good night, item acquired. Oh boy, it's everyone's favorite room! Amethyst core item acquired. Increases the size of range attacks, but first I need to finish these masteries and then I can use that. How about... Oh, shit. Ah! Okay. Mmm... Mmm... I kind of felt like that with the raid sponsorships. I felt dirty even asking my viewers what their thoughts on it was. You got a raid sponsorship already? I'm jelly. <laughs> I've done two of those already, as in... I've helped two streamers out with raid sponsorships. Raids with raid... Motherfucker, I can't speak. Raid sponsorships so far. It's... They're very... I notice it's very straightforward. You don't need to do much shilling. You just need to... I guess, stream it. Until... A certain number of people, um, guess, uh, unlock, blah, 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 unlock the thing in the game, right? The first time I did it, 
all we had to do was to sign up. The second time I did it, they had to actually put in a gamer code of some kind. <laughs> really? If you sign up to use stream elements, you get it right away? So it might be a stream elements thing then, huh? That's interesting. Very interesting. <laughs> no! God damn it, I forgot to get the thing again. Ah! Why do I keep doing this to myself? Oh my god, it's the best item ever, the Raiden. This, the broken, the broken fucking item. <laughs> oh, yes. Just look at the level of detail on those characters. I know, right? Who could say no to that? Who could say no to free stuff, for that matter? Bet you can't, and neither can I. Yep. <laughs> I had a lot more interest in doing it than I thought, but I'm probably not doing it. The interest doesn't didn't pass the minimum threshold, so it's probably not worth. Yeah, fair enough. <laughs> Dragonheart's pretty cool, actually. But I want to preserve these things so I could use them for something else. Even though I don't have access to those something else's for a little bit. Dragon Rake. Just needs one of these. Give me the... Mm -hmm. Actually, energy drone is pretty good too, but right now I'm just trying to unlock as many of these things as I possibly can for the time being. Another one of these. SK-7 missile. Another one of these things. Another one of these things. We'll keep the metal chunk. And I don't think the game's gonna let me... Because I'm pretty sure Ice Bomb... Oh, never mind. I can get rid of Ice Bomb. Another harpoon? <laughs> ah! Ow! 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 This is why I do not like care for spears that much, unfortunately. Oh, shit. Ow. <laughs> oh, that's really easy. Another crappy sword. Thanks for nothing, game. Much appreciates. <laughs> Good thing you could stagger those. Mm -hmm. 
You know what? I take it back. This spear is pretty okay. All things considered. Raiden is so broken. I love Raiden. But does Raiden love me? I didn't think so. Another shitty great another great sword? They come. I can hear the faint sound of lightning. Okay, Scouter, what's the Scouter say about his scouting level? It's over 9,000! This is a short sword, looks more like a dagger. Bro, I am, you are the storm that's provoking, that's approaching. I'll show you a storm that's approaching. Ow, 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 ow. I meant to do that. That was intentional. You know, I'm kind of getting used to dagger weapons now. Ow! What the shit was that? A tactical decision to take damage for no reason. A lot of monsters are nesting here. That's why I'm going to annoy them. <laughs> Gotta show the lightning some due respect. How about you ride lightning? <laughs> Why do I keep forgetting to grab that? Holy shit, I am dumb. Oh my god, I feel so dumb. Oh, it's my worst enemy, a logic puzzle. There we go. I remember this now. Fiery Egg is pretty good too, if I recall correctly. Equip the Falcon with it. Hmm. Yeah, like I said, it's kind of busted. <laughs> And by kinda, I mean extremely busted. Bust a move, busted. Bust these nuts, busted. Yeah, I don't know what it is. I really like... There's some games that I really enjoy a lot, but they fatigue the shit out of me, especially 4X games. And there are games, very rare games like this, that... Don't fatigue the shit out of me. I just always feel like I want to play it that I love a lot as well. I can't explain my thought process either. It's a very strange thought process. A thought pro- even a thought process, if you will. That was a very bad joke. I apologize that that pun made absolutely zero sense. <laughs> Ooh, Arma. Comfy. Yeah, comfy. I guess there is no better term than the term comfy for that prop for that uh healing, I suppose. Time to find more loot. Wait, what's with this one? Oh no. Oh, okay, I don't need to use this anymore. Cool. Ah! 
<laughs> See, that's just exhilarating when you do stupid shit like that. Ah! Another spear? Eh. A weaker spear at that. One second. <laughs> Lulz Desu indeed. Let us continue our journey. We're going to bully the shit out of the lightning dragon. That's going to be fun. Supper time soon. Supper time is supposed to be right now, but I want to finish this run first. And then I'll need to save my game again. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Some traps are still laying around. Why do they even have traps in these cityscapes, one must be wondering. I do not have the answer, and we will not find any answers. Wait, these rocks actually float around and follow me everywhere? I love how chaotic this game has. Why is Kiev have traps? <laughs> uh, that's a good question. You might as well ask them why they have femboys. Get it? Huh. I love how chaotic this game gets when you really just start using everything at your disposal. It's beautiful. And just like that, I got masteries on all of these things now. In fact, I got masteries on everything in my inventory. Cool. <laughs> Alright. Here it is. The lightning bastard. Lightning dragon. Okay. We might actually win this one. Emphasis on the might, though. You never know sometimes. Here we go. You 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. I fought you before, buddy. That's weird. Why is my character not saying her voice line anymore? Did something happen? Maybe it's glitching out? Oh, but he's firing his laser. And he's going to... Yep. Call that out. And you're dead. Got on the first try this time. Probably because I've played this game enough times to know what I need to do. And also because I got some good loot to begin with. Easy, well played, indeed. I didn't get that many crystal cores from it, though, so that kind of sucks, but, eh. Progress. Okay, I need freeze resistance, too. Burn effects, auto potion. I need, I really need crystal cores. 24 hour live stream. I could try one in the weekend, see what happens. For now, though, I gotta go grab dinner. Thank you so much, everyone, for coming to tonight's stream. Even with the minor crash that we had, I, thanks to the upgrades to my computer, I was able to recover fairly quickly. Should we raid a new one tonight? I'm trying to look up who's available for raiding, but my app, Twitch app is bugging out. Um, here we go. Who's all streaming? Um... Sika Piratu, Do Guy Joey, Karadine, Wen Bunka, Fiori Sakai, Nakan Yancer. You know, I don't think we've rated Nakan Yancer before. Nakan Yancer is actually from Danger U, believe it or not. So let's pay them a visit. They're playing Halo Infinite right now. Let me just exit out of here really quick. Gonna wave goodbye to everyone, and let's go ahead and send y'all to Nekanyanser. Prepare for it a big drop. Here we go.